and let's add a dependent because that's usually what's necessary to make them uh, a a uh, and let's say the dependence on 01 uh, 15 to 20 let's say social security da, 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 and then son da, da, da. and then we're gonna say that marital status is now head of household head of the household I wasn't I was head of the household when I was single too it's just that it was an easier household to manage back the back then I feel like anyways head of household Sam uh, Sam taxman uh, is now the son also trying to avoid the dang taxman and now the standard deductions up to the 20,800 so if I go back on over that would mean okay standard deduction is at the 20,800 boom to get us to the taxable income 79,200 79,200 page number two then has the tax 11,131 so 11,131 and then I can get into the credit of the 2,000 credit so I have an other credit 2,000 for the child tax credit so that pulls in boom and then we go okay and then so that means that the the refund now 2869 2869 okay but what if he was blind what if he was blind then i go okay what if he was blind though then we can say boom and then if i go back on over to the first page standard deduction goes up from 22 to 22650 which would basically be I can mirror this by saying this plus another 1850 22650 bringing the taxable income to 77350 77350 you can also see that on my chart 1040 SR page 4 where we're now talking about uh, head of household so now 22650 right if one of one box was checked off okay let's go back and say page two calculates the tax at 10,724 uh, 10,724 